Hello, this is Graham from Let's Learn This dot com. Um, so we've reached tutorial ten. We covered a lot of ground in the previous tutorials, um, and now it's uh, homework time, I'm afraid. So we're going to have a look at something which I hope will be uh, quite interesting, and that's a little game in Python. Now I'm going to show you the game, and then I want you to try and replicate it. And then in the next tutorial, I'll show you what I did to to make the game and uh, you can compare it to what you did. Now there's obviously going to be more than one way of doing this but everything that I've used within my code has been things that we've covered so far in the tutorials. So let's uh, run the game. So here I've made my, uh, file, my file in the idle GUI and then saved it as game.py on my desktop so that I can just double click it to run okay so it's saying please enter your name so I'm going to enter my name here and then it says hello Graham welcome to the game are you sure you want to play so the thing that you've got to do here is make sure that you print out the um, players name okay um, and so here it's asking for a yes no answer but I want you to um, check for yes and no but I also want you to check for anything else so um, let's put in uh, badgers and you can see what I mean so it says I'm sorry I don't understand badgers please enter yes or no so it keeps going around there until you give it some input that it recognizes okay now it's asking you here to um, type yes or no in this format but I want you to check that you can type the word in any uh, upper or lower case. So when you press enter again it says can you tell me the result of 7 plus 3? So what it's doing here is taking two numbers and adding them together and seeing if you, when you add them together yourself you get the same result. So let's try it then. So 7 plus 3 is 10 and then it says well done Graham you got it right would you like another question? Um, if I say yes, it says, here's the question. Can you tell me the result of 7 plus 1? 8. Well done, Graham, you got it right. Would you like another qu question? I'm going to say yes again there. And then it says, this one might be tricky. So notice that as it goes round and delivers another question, it's saying something else here. So if you remember back from the random tutorial, there's something in there that will help you do that. Okay, so let's get the answer wrong this time. Let's say uh, 5 plus 9 is 2. And then it says, Sorry, Graham, that's wrong. The answer was 14. So if you get it wrong, the computer tells you what the answer is, so you, you, you can check it. Okay, um, okay, so it's asking if we want another question. Let's say no this time. Okay, then it says, Suit yourself then. Goodbye, Graham and then it gives us a prompt saying press a key to exit and so when we press a key it exits okay so you should have everything you need in the tutorials to make that game go and see how you get on uh, if you get stuck don't worry I'm going to show you exactly how to do it um, in the next tutorial um, but have a go that's the main thing because putting your knowledge um, to work is the best way of learning Alright then, well I'll catch you next time. Bye.